hello and welcome to, I don't know what, what to call this, this is just some quick little tutorial thing that I wanted to do. Uh, this is how you upload to Cast Garden. Once you get your Cast Garden account set up and your Hive account linked up and all that, you go to this little button up here, it says publish. Okay, you've created your video, you got your thumbnail ready to go. You got your show notes your description ready to go. And you go to the publish button here. Hit the publish button. Brings you to this page. Um, if you're importing from a URL, like from YouTube or whatever, you paste in that and then fill out the required information. But if we're, you're uploading a file, one that you've already done, so I'm doing this. These are all the extensions it can take. Uh, WebM. OGV, OG, MP4, MKV, MOV, QT, MQV, M4V, blah, 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 blah. It can even take audio files. And then you give it a thumbnail and it will match that up and create a video for you. So we've got our MP4. So we're going to select the file to upload, which I have right here and over the, off, off the rails. It's in the vids. And this last night's show, 429.23 is what I did it as and then this will go here you see it starts uploading here while you're taking care of everything else so this is what this is uh how i usually name my videos i don't know why i didn't put a space in there on the file but your file will be the default name unless you name it something else this one i'm we're just calling it the weekly meme dump Then I've got my show notes description already filled out up in there off screen. And we just I just paste those in. Yes, it takes um, markdown, simple markdown, nothing fancy like you see on other markdown places. But I I just write mine out like this because I will typically sometimes typically sometimes cross post onto YouTube and I will go ahead and you know do it that way which I didn't really think this through because I could have just uploaded this to YouTube because I've got it now nah, I ain't gonna do with that screw it I ain't putting it on YouTube fuck YouTube uh anyways you get your description in there that you want to get your tags but this is the, the the tutorial so I'm gonna I've got the tutorials tags sticking in my head so I need to do something like entertainment and it was a live show so I'll put live in there um, I'll put in comedy memes and then uh, the channel is defluence because that's the only channel I got um, category I'm going to call this comedy and then this is something new. This is a new feature here on Cast Garden. Your Hive community that you're going to post it to. You can go through here and I'm not sure if it shows all of the communities or if it shows just the ones that you are a member of. But I'm putting mine in the def the uh, Defluence chat because that's mine. Just tick the box there. Um... And then your your license, whether it's uh, attribution, you know, these are all like Creative Commons license. I usually do the non-commercial share alike because I want people to share it, but it's not for any commercial purposes. Um, I usually just go with the instance language, which is English, and then publish after transcoding. Uh, that will be available once it finishes uploading captions if you have a caption closed caption file this is where you would upload it i do not um then for the advanced settings this is where you do your your video thumbnail i've already got my video thumbnail made typically they always say 1920 by 1080 don't do that don't 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 upload a, a big huge thumbnail like that thumbnails look just fine 
in a ratio of eight eight hundred by four fifty. That's still a sixteen by nine. And and a little trick you can do is this right here. Tiny yeah, tinypng.com. And you you don't have to have a uh, PNG. It can be JPEG too. But I'm going to go find mine thumbnail and I am going to uh where's it at podcast so with the uh buttons four twenty nine twenty three and I'm gonna drag it into that little square right there and it's gonna be reduced by thirty seven percent in size and then I'm gonna download that and then I'm gonna go over here to my downloads and replace that file with this new one okay then I'll go back over here click on that edit button go to the thumbnail folder 42923 see how tiny that is 24.2 and another thing that'll help with your thumbnails is keeping the just like one or one or two colors you know the contrasting colors I've got basically three colors in mine black gray and white so that will help help greatly reduce the size so i'm going to pause this and we'll be back when uh, the upload finishes okay that's done now we're ready to publish so what we do is we make sure we, ena we enable download if you want somebody to be able to download it and then we enable video comments, so if you want people to, to comment on it. Go back over to our basic info, make sure everything is correct. Our title is right, channel is right, category is right. The, the uh, community that we are posting to is Defluence Chat right there. I thought I had that checked, but I may not have. But uh, we got our language filled out. And our license is done, contains sensitive content. That's a, uh, that's a NSFW, you know, like showing nudity and stuff. Don't leave, make sure you, you mark that. And then publish after transcoding. You can always tick on these question marks to, you know, read what the, any questions you may have. And then don't go up here to this button. That, that starts a new one. You want the one down here at the bottom. Hit publish. And you will wait and you'll see this little message. And it should start playing here in just a second. But it's not ready because it's still transcoding. Whoa. Okay. That was that took a, quite a long time because that is a huge file that I uploaded. It's a two-hour video from last night's Off the Rails. Um, then, you know... It, It'll be published once it once it's ready. You can find it in my videos and see where it says public waiting transcoding. Once it transcodes, it will automatically post and you'll be able to see it on the recently added page. And then you'll get a notification up here that you got that your stuff is ready. Or it is ready. And then you can share it. So that's it. That's how you upload to um, cash card, simple, easy, super easy peasy. Can't get any easier than that. <laughs> we'll see you guys again next time. I'll show you how to set up a live.